This is the Pyrenees of the Sudwest, a region of fast flowing torrents just a few kilometers from the Spanish border. The local gastronomy is very rustic and it has some very strong flavors. The town of saint giron has one of the most colorful and charming markets of the region. The ham from the Pyrenees is one of the best in France. We know that the Spanish ham is perhaps the best in the world, but it's just over the side, so you can imagine the quality is not very different. And people really have a slice of ham at the beginning of many meals. See, I've already had a couple, and they use it in omelettes, they use it in cassoulet, and there's a dish of trout where they stuff the ham in the trout. One of the wonderful things about the Pyrenees region is that there's a, a large amount of wild mushroom in the forest on the side of the Pyrenees. And we have got some girol and some bouton de guette. It's absolutely fabulous. It goes well with chicken, it goes well with stews and even in a salad. The views of the Pyrenees are breathtaking. The local cows have a feast eating the rich grass and flowers of the high pastures. Not only are those cows friendly, but they also produce a superb milk used in the raw form to make a great cheese called bête mal. I am visiting Jean Faupe, run by Didier Le Masson, a cheese master at the Fromagerie that collects local milk from cows exclusively fed on grass. Once made, the cheese is salted by hand and ripened on pine planks for two to three months during which it develops a natural rind. The result is outstanding, with smooth and supple texture and wonderful floral and nutty flavors. Superb! Lamb is one of the most popular local meats and this stew called Navarin d'Agneau is a great French classic. Top French chef Philippe Mouchel who work with the French legend Paul Bocuse cooks a superb navarin. Donc le navarin d'agneau c'est un plat de printemps dont on utilise l'épaule. Euh donc c'est braisé doucement et garni avec des petits légumes. Des petits légumes de printemps le printemps et l'hiver on met ou des haricots ou alors des pommes de terre. Philippe brands about 1 kg of lamb shoulders and neck pieces in a little batter and oil. He stirs in one diced carrot and one diced onion. And after a few minutes, he mixes two tablespoons of plain flour and three diced tomatoes. He covers with stock, mixes well, and adds some chopped garlic and a bouquet garni, then cooks, covered in the oven, for about two hours until tender. The traditional garnish is cooked baby carrots, turnips, onions, peas and potatoes, and they are all reheated together. The Navarra is served sprinkled with chopped parsley. It is stunning and so delicious. So the Navarra d'agneau printanier, un des grands plats de la cuisine française, et un des plats préférés de Paul Bocuse. Tomorrow we arrive in the sunny Languedoc-Roussillon and we discover the very delicious specialties of the town of Sète.